Welcome to my crib. <laughs> Welcome to our channel. How do you vlog, vlog anymore? It's been so long since we vlogged, but we wanted to make sure we did a house tour because we've done a little series over here of building our house. So I wanted to give you guys a little house tour of what it looks like now that we've officially moved in and been moved in for like two months now. Everything, and it's still not done. Yeah, it's not done. It's not perfect. The house is still, you know, we have stuff laying around everywhere. We're about to go on vacation. Um, we have piles of donation stuff, and we also have a toddler and a baby who is currently sleeping in her room, so I'll have to get that footage later. Let's just get started at the entryway. I'll get Connor to film. So we have our entryway. We have this light that we put in, which is super bright. It's like a little starburst. The bulbs are... Oh, yeah, there it goes. There you can kind of see it. This is the light that we put in in the entryway. We wanted to do something super fun. Okay, so then... We, I have my little entryway area, and we'll probably do something different than this eventually, but I have some thrifted things that kind of tie the whole space together. We have an entryway closet, which is just Connor's coats and other what? miscellaneous Random crap. stuff. Let's move this way into this little hallway area. We might do some chairs and like a little table here someday. Um, but we do have our family photos back from my maternity pictures with Rory. Um, and then come in here. We're, we're getting rid of all this stuff too. Oh yeah, this is donations. <laughs> and we're about to go on vacation, like I said, so. This is our mud room. So our garage is over here, which I guess I can show you. It's just a two car garage. With a bunch of stuff. <laughs> awesome. Connor's done a really good job of organizing it, I feel like, though, so. It looks better than when we Connor's moved in. Connor's fixing this up. He doesn't ride a motorcycle. I do, too. Here's our mudroom bench. So right now it's obviously just filled with all of our stuff, so like your school stuff and my work stuff and our diaper bag and just, you know, papers and stuff. But we did this green color, which I think I've mentioned before in previous videos, but I'll put the color by Sherwin-Williams here for you. Um, so yeah, and then off of the mudroom is our laundry room, and just very simple, that same green, um, color. I think it's actually called gray, but it looks green. Harbor's gray? It's like Homburg gray, I think. Homburg gray. So it's called gray, but it looks green. Yeah. Alright, now we're gonna move into the living room. Like I said, we're going on vacation, so ignore the suitcases. Um, but we got this couch back when we were living in our duplex. Behind me, you have the fireplace. Um, Connor actually did the tile when we were moving, when we were living here. So he did all the tile work on the fireplace. The color on these open shelving is um, iron ore as well, which I have mentioned in previous videos. And we kind of showed how we made um, these Sorry. like fake built-ins. So they're not I'll show you. okay. So these built-ins are not actually like real built-ins. We just did shelving, which Connor did, and then we painted the wall behind it, and we painted like the wood and the shelving and stuff to make it look like built-ins. Like built yeah. But these are like real cabinets. These are actually really awesome. So um, I have showed these in previous videos. These are some of my favorite things. One of my favorite things that we did in this house is we put these giant drawers in here they have all these toys and stuff because our playroom is off of the living room. Connor actually built this mantle as well. It is a huge, beautiful mantle. It sticks out really far. What is the color of the stain? Dark, dark walnut. I dark walnut, the and this wood is? That's pine. Pine. All right, let's move over here. So I have just a little seating area over here. Um, we have put these green curtains up, but we have tons of windows over here and here. Well, our floors all are just vinyl. Vinyl planks. planks. I don't know what color, yeah. sorry. Um, okay, so we'll move over here into the dining room. Everything's very open concept, so now we're in the dining room. Got our light picture. Um, like I said, nothing is like perfect right now, so obviously we have like our high chair and Riker's stuff all over the table, but yeah, so that's our dining room. Yeah. Basically. Okay. Best and part. then we have our kitchen, which I guess is the best part. But the 
The backsplash is coming, which will be even better, but you yeah. guys probably won't ever get to see that. Yeah. So we have the island right here. The island is a different color. I don't know if you can see it from here, but the island is the same color as the Milton's. Kind of, you can it's tell. iron ore as well. It's a bluish. Uh, so come around here. These cabinets are a different color than the walls are. The cabinet color I'll put right here. I'm not really sure what the color is. Isn't that snowbound? Snowbound is what's on the wall. So then it's um, Gossamer Veil. We put all kind of mismatched um, handles for all the drawers. So I'm gonna, I put all these like mis mismatched drawers and knobs. So the knobs pulls. are different than the pulls up here. Um, <clears throat> We have this glass cabinet that we installed over here, which the decor in here is not my favorite. I'm gonna eventually do something with this that looks a lot better, but for now it works. And then we have our pantry, just a little corner pantry, Riker's favorite room in the house. Oh yeah, so, so is Daddy. I just recently did an organization of this pantry because it was a mess. I just did some Dollar Tree baskets and it looks a lot better. And here's our master bedroom. Eventually, I'm gonna get some curtains for over here. Um, the room is actually probably smaller than most master bedrooms, but that's how we wanted it. Something very cozy, could fit our king size bed in and possibly you know, put a TV up on the wall someday if we want to. Um, we have space to walk all the way back to our bathroom. It's also a little cluttered in here because like I said, we're about to go out of town. And this is as good as it's gonna get for now. We did these countertops that are different sizes. <laughs> so Connor's is taller, you can tell, and mine is a lot shorter. Oh yeah, you can we tell. Are a foot apart in length. This green color is the same color that's in the mudroom and in the laundry room. We have our bathtub that Connor says he can't fit into it, but it's huge. <laughs> um, we finally, finally got our glass shower put in literally like a couple weeks ago. So we've been showering in the kids' bathroom up until a couple weeks ago. Um, so we're super glad to finally have this in. Oh. All the supply shortages and stuff, it's just taking a long time for things to get in. And we've had to live with things that Take a while. Take a while to get in, yeah. even though since we have been the builders of the house, we've been able to do that and not have to wait on things to come in, if that makes sense. Yeah. All right, we have a pooper room. We have a pooper room in here. There's also a cabinet behind the door in here. Um, so we just have, you know, bathroom stuff, towel sheets, all that kind of stuff. Linen cabinet sort of deal. So then we'll go to the closet. The closet is kind of our office too, even though we don't really, I feel like we don't really come in here to sit very often. Or at least I don't. I do. So. I love it in here. My side of the closet, Connor's side. And then we have office. We did this last minute window installed to have a little bit of light in here. I put that window Connor in. Connor put this window in all by himself. It took me um, three days. To put one window in. It's okay. It worked. <laughs> now you know how to put windows in. Exactly. Hey, yeah, that's pretty much the closet. So we'll go to the playroom. So our kids are playing in here right now. So that's why it's a mess. I'm not going to try to clean it while he's playing. So it got looks like a little clean. jumper here. But the room is 8 by 10, so it's pretty small. Um, technically, if we were to sell the house, it would be considered an office. Uh, we have all the kids' toys and stuff in here. Baby toys. This room changes quite often because I haven't figured out what I want to do with it. Something fun someday. We'll see. Bye. So yeah, that's pretty much the playroom. Okay, so actually since we've filmed the video of our tour, we've actually redone this room. So I wanted to show you guys real quick. Uh, we painted the walls green in here and it looks crazy awesome. Connor installed some shelves in here. Um, and over here we did like a little picture wall over oh, here there we go. and then we did these frames they used to be black and we spray painted them gold so we redid this room a little bit um so i wanted to put this in the video since i'm just now editing it and then into the hallway we just have the hallway rory is sleeping so on this side is riker's room he just has a little bed in here 
What in the world happened? Oh, I'm, it's crooked. So we just have Riker's twin bed in here, and then he also has a drum set that he got when we moved in, and then he has a dresser right here with all his clothes, and then he also has a closet over here. Um, that's got, you know, it's just an average, smallish, guest sort of situation kind of closet. Nothing too fancy there. It's got a double window over here. Um, yeah, you show him, Riker. Thank you, Riker. And then across the hall is Rory's room, but she's sleeping right now, so we'll just show you the bathroom. So here's the kids' bathroom slash or like guest bathroom, bathroom that people use when they come to our house. Um, two vanities. Um, just kind of your average Joe appliance. Is that what it's called? Fixtures. Fixtures. Um, Appliances, yeah. The same color that's in the kitchen cabinets is in here. And then when you turn the corner, we have a little pocket drawer that Connor installed all by himself. And then our kid, the kids' bathroom shower, which is where we were showering and stuff for a while, is back here. The open, the poop open toilet. Pooper toilet. And M Ms <laughs> for when we go potty. Yeah, so we do have a little linen cabinet over here. Yeah, so let's go back into the living room. So that's about it. I'll insert a video of Rory's room right now. Okay, so finally a month later we're filming Rory's room because I completely forgot until I started editing the video where we show you our house. This is Rory's room. So we just put her crib over here and cute little name thing and then her changing area is over here. And then she has kind of the same closet situation that Riker has in here. She has been sick, so we have like humidifier and stuff all set up in here. And so yeah, yeah, that's that's why it looks the way it looks. But that's Roy's room. All right, so that is um, everything we wanted to show you about our house. Oh, we do we do have our backyard. We should show you oh, the backyard because yeah, we, we have been updating the backyard. All right. Oh, I just mowed it too. It looks so. So Connor good. installed. <laughs> Installed. What's the word? Connor laid the sod all by himself. Literally. Almost. Kind of. <laughs> I laid the backyard by myself. So the lot that we bought is we chose to build like a smaller house for the lot size so that we could have a bigger backyard. So we have this big old porch. We were able to put a sectional over here. Yeah. And then we also have table and chairs right here. Yeah. And then as you can see our big beautiful Grassy yard, um, so and then over nice. here is our like dirt pit. <laughs> Eventually we want to do like a pergola, maybe some rock or something, somewhere where the kids can play. Fire pit, play pergola. Play set area, garden, I don't know. It's, oh, it's, open, it's, to, it's open to interpretation. Open to interpretation. <laughs> All right, so that is about it. Thank you guys for joining me on this house tour. Thank you um, to everyone that's watched our um, home building series here on youtube um the next video i will have a little bit of an announcement to make so don't uh. miss that um so thank you guys so much for watching and we will see you in the next video <laughs> bye what's up dude this is, a mug of this, right is, here. this is not about our toddler oh sorry shut that door dude okay lock it all the um, way turn it all the way it's, it's not time to work on the motorcycle come on you and your church clothes, come on. This color is iron ore. Stop, you do not do that. No, sir. No, you can go. Well, you gotta come that. on this side. Yeah, you gotta look that back that way.